basically we were going to put out covert versions of the books. So the verbiage would be completely changed. Like the Nazis would be something totally different, like a totally different word altogether. And everything would be basically in parables. You have to speak in parables for fear of the Jews, literally. So we were going to put out these covert ones. But what happened is it was under my friend's account, but with my bank account. They knew it was my bank account and banned his account based on the bank account. They said, no, we banned you. Different IP address, different person altogether, completely separate Amazon account, everything. And they knew strictly by the checking account number. So Amazon has just, they have just got way too much power, way too much power. So now I have to keep the printer I have completely secret because if even one Jew or Shabbos Goyim, one of their force multipliers reports it, it's over. They'll ban yeah. all. And they do have their Shabbos Goyim because that's what oh, got me do. terminated at my job. The State Farm was Shabbos Goyim that were, said they were Hebrew, like Hebrew, these Hebrew roots Christians. Yeah. Um, because I was I'm speaking Jewish. against the Jews in the Holocaust. <laughs> that becomes more important to these Christians. If you deny the Holocaust, you are like persona non grata. But if you deny the, the cross of Jesus, you're more likely to stay in fellowship than if you deny the Holocaust with these Christians. It's amazing. Well, you can be you could tell a Christian, you know, I, I think Satan is really God. And they'd be like, hmm, yeah, I hear you. That's that's yep. different. But yeah, I, I get it. I, they're just so dumbed down. 